The job market has been difficult for everyone this year, especially college students. But there are certain skills that work in any economy. Now, one of them is the ability to sell. Tonight, ABC 7's Wayne Freeman on an old-fashioned company that is still teaching it and helping students make some money in the process. In hard times like this, is it too much to suggest that what the world really needs is a college girl who is good with knives? It's nice to know that if you walked into a place and they were weird, you would I know. I can defend myself, I guess. <laughs> Although when Christine Hanks comes calling, it's the resident who may be defenseless, but in a good way. Um, have you ever heard of Cutco before? Cutco is a New York-based knife company that has used college kids as salespeople since 1949. The company trains them, and even in a recession, the staff of 15,000 kids has done fairly well. $209 million in sales last year alone. Hi, Jane. This is Christine. In 13 months of the worst economy since the Depression, Christine has developed her own contacts and made close to $40,000 part-time. There's always a sale made. Either they sell you or you sell them. So this right here, it just falls right off. A Cutco visit is kind of like having an infomercial sit down at your kitchen table, an act of selling as performance art. As Carla Mills and her kids watched, Christine sliced and diced. Then she took a penny and cut through it with a pair of shears. After a show like this, who wouldn't pay $63 for a do-it-all cheese knife? You could buy a machine that would do that a lot faster. Yeah, but then you have to clean up the machine. That takes a lot more time than just rinsing it off. You got all the answers, don't you? <laughs> Plus, this is guaranteed forever. So if ever chips, breaks, rust, anything. So you have an answer for everything. I do, I do. It's my job. <laughs> so if you ever wondered what happened to Willie Loman, here's the reincarnation in female form. Carla got her knife, the kids got a mangled penny as a keepsake, and as they say, a good sale leaves everybody happy. So when you see your friends sitting around doing nothing... <laughs> I show him my paycheck. <laughs> From Fremont, Wayne Friedman, ABC7 News. Man, she's, she's good, too. That's, that's tough work, too, though. I'm interested in those knives now. <laughs>